So the SwissCube project is the first Swiss satellite in space. You're here now seeing the uh, mission control room of the satellite from which we downloaded the first images. The SwissCube belongs to the CubeSat family of satellites, which basically specifies its dimensions and its weight. The mock-up that you see here is a real size uh, mock-up and it is 10 by 10 by 10 centimeters and in our case SwissCube weighs 820 grams. The objective of this project was primarily to educate students. From that perspective it was a great success because we had about 200 students coming from all over Switzerland and participating in the design and the test and the flight of this satellite. The SwissCube images are actual measurements of a phenomena called the air glow that happens on top of the uh, atmosphere at about 100 km altitude or so. Um, these images are low resolution um, and it takes us a few minutes to download them. SwissCube was launched in September 2009. Uh, right after launch we realized that it was spinning around one of the axes really fast. That was not planned. So we tried a few things and uh, soon realized that it was actually best for us to let it despin naturally and slowly. That despin took about one year. Um, now we have to realize that this satellite was designed to survive in space for four months. So after one year we had some technical problems. Um, but two students, one from a former student and one from the Netherlands, came by and uh, had great ideas on how to drain the batteries to restart the satellite and then to implement a new algorithms to really uh, decrease the spinning even more and we tried it and it worked. That was at the beginning of 2011. So since uh, February, uh, mid-February of uh, 2011 we've been able to download its first images and we are extremely proud and happy about it. Thank <laughs> you.